joining us, we are staying with our coverage of the NSAR's one-year anniversary, where earlier today, protesters gathered in some parts of the country in solidarity with victims of police brutality. That protest in October 2020 led to the disbandment of the Special anti robbery Squad of the Nigeria Police. In Lagos, the police fired tear gas canister at the Lekki Toll Gate, where celebrities and youths held a memorial, a memorial car procession. Scores of youths, including celebrities, were participating in the parade amid the presence of armed security operatives before they were dispersed. As at 8 a.m., many of the young Nigerians filled up several cars and buses, blaring horns as they drove through the toll plaza. And as the event continued, the number of youths at the venue grew, while others came down from their cars chanting solidarity songs. However, a mild drama ensued when some members of the press and protesters were arrested by security operatives and thrown into police vans stationed at the venue of the protest. But after proper identification, the arrested journalists were released while others were still detained. Among the, the arrested persons was a man who claimed to be a military personnel. I'm not doing anything. They call me. I'm army. I'm, I'm, I'm going to Bonny Camp. Yes, I'm going to Insta Bonny Camp. The commissioner of police is still here trying to sort out things now, as you can see. The Lagos State Commissioner of Police, Hakim Odumosu, who was also at the venue, said the police only used the minimum force to disperse miscreants and not the youth participating in the memorial procession. He added that the arrested persons would be prosecuted after investigations. We attended the police station. We obtained that statement now. We now do investigation. One well, investigation will reveal their feet. At the end of the investigation, now we do what the law says we should do. Lagos General is calm. The authority of Lagos General is calm. So the traditional areas of the, the assemblage so are taken care of. We got that information. We got that the intelligence report. That's what miscounts want to infiltrate. Actually, miscounts infiltrated here. Yeah. But the other areas now, like Surulere, like the stadium, so like the Anifami Park now, so everywhere is calm. Lagos is completely calm. Meanwhile, after occupying the Lekito Gate area for several hours, the ENSA's procession in that part of Lagos has come to an end. TVC News correspondent Theophilos Ilama, who is still at the toll gate earlier, to, to, who is still at the toll gate, earlier reports that the area is calm, peaceful, and vehicular movement restored to normal. Although security personnel are still stationed in the area, residents and other road users are seen going about their normal duties without delay or fear. The Lekki Toll Gate area was earlier today occupied by protesters who were marking the one-year anniversary of a protest that almost brought the country to her knees. The Lekki Toll Gate became significant on a day like that because of the alleged shooting of protesters by security operatives when the protest against police brutality took place on 20th October 2020. 